Hey guys, welcome to another plugin tutorial. Today it's on armor stand tools. So this is a really awesome plugin which allows you to create these armor stand NPCs with name tags, different heads, different clothing, different sizes, and you can change um, where their limbs are and whatnot. So as you can see, this is my first test subject, and um, it didn't go well, if I'm honest. Um, so these are my second and third attempts. So I made a tiny Zephos and a big one with uh, some clothing on. So if you do um, AST, you will get all of these uh, items in your inventory. So if you left click, it will um, fling through to the next set, which uh, you can change the arms. If you left click again, it will go to the legs and left click again to the head and body and left click again, and we'll be back to where we started. So um, for the first item, you can just right click this and that will summon um, an armor stand so you can right click it, move it about, fly around with it uh, and put it anywhere you want. I want one up here. There we go. Lovely. Um, so once you've done that you can get the GUI multi tool. So right click it, let's just use this one down here. Um, right click it and then you can change the armor if you want. You can uh, undress it like this and maybe put some gold armor on it. Um, so right click it again put the armor on. You can't do this using shift, so you have to actually drag it yourself, like that. And there are all these options over here. So um, first of all, we can uh, look at the size. You can make him really tiny, and his armor even goes tiny. That's really cool. You can toggle gravity on and off, so obviously uh, this guy up here, he's floating at the moment, um, so he would fall down if I turned it off. Um, and you can also toggle on in vulnerability so they can actually be killed. Uh, so let me fly back to this one and um, look at some of the other things. You can change the name that appears above his head. So um, Gold Armor Guy is going to be his name. Like that, which is really, really cool. And you can right click him and change the head. Uh, so whatever name you use, it will look up their skin. For example, um, Honeydew, let's see if this works. Is that his name? So it takes a few seconds, and there we go. That is Honeydew from the Yogscast um, in my server. Tee hee hee. Um, so as you can see, there are lots of others. You can toggle him visible or invisible. You can pick him up and move him. If you didn't like where he was the first time, let's move him next to Zephos. There we go. That's pretty cool. You can clone him. So you can have an army of uh, armor stand Zephoses, I mean uh, honeydews, like that. Uh, let's just put them down. Ooh. And right click to put them down. There we go. And you can um, create a command block to summon this armor, but you probably wouldn't want to do that. Um, and yeah, that's pretty cool on how you do that. So let's look at the rotation. Obviously get the rotation tool out and you can rotate him by right clicking. Left clicking obviously toggles um, what items you have in your inventory. Um, so yeah, you can make him face whichever way you want. Uh, the move X and Y, obviously uh, if you hit F3 you can look at the coordinates and you can move him up if you want. Up, 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 up and up, 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 you go. So yeah, you can move him anywhere you want and then if we were to toggle on gravity he falls down. So if you left click, uh, this is the bit where you can uh, mess up their bodies. So let's let's use this guy as the test subject. If you right click left arm, that gets moved. And obviously you can move it where you want. Um, oh god, that's not good. <laughs> um, <laughs> stop doing that salute. That's not good. <clears throat> yes, naughty. Mustn't do that. Um, okay, well... Uh, Let's leave him alone. He obviously wants to get on with that. Um, let's, let's use the other arm. And uh, the legs. <coughs> you can probably change these as well. The Y, the Z, the X. <coughs> uh, he seems to be doing an inspirational dance. So you can, you can do this a lot. Um, <coughs> looks really, really cool. You can mess around with this. Just right clicking, trying to get it right. Uh, if you hold right click and drag, I think that's probably the best way to do it. Uh, rather than just spam clicking. But uh, this is a really cool plugin. Left click again and we can mess around with the head. So the Y is probably what we want to mess around with. 
so you can make him look in any direction. Uh, he's looking over here at something. The Z is looking up. And the X, you can move that as well. So the body, you can twist this around, sorry, and uh, flip it around. So yeah, left click and we're back to normal. Um, and let's try and delete this guy. Can we delete him? Uh, hopefully we can. If I get rid of these, he should uh, be invisible, hopefully. Yeah, he turns invisible. And if we got rid of the name tag, uh, yeah, he's completely gone. Good. So, yeah, that is the plugin. Um, hopefully, you can create better um, armor stands than this and this. Uh, this wasn't too bad, and this is all right. But, um, yeah, it's a brilliant plugin. I found it while looking uh, through Spigot. So, you can download this plugin for free. You can mess around it on your server, maybe give it to donators. It's just a lot of fun just trying to make a really cool. Um, NPC. So subscribe, like, comment, and I'll see you next time.